Hey guys, it's me. Welcome back uh, to the channel, guys. If you are new, you are welcome. Uh, all right, guys. Oh, geez, welcome back. We're doing betrayal and lies, guys. Somebody's always lying. Somebody's always being betrayed. Leaving someone else in tears. <laughs> to hell. All right, guys. What is going on? What is going on? What is going on? Guys, I started juicing. Like, y'all know I make the smoothies, but now I'm juicing, juicing. Like, this here, guys, this is watermelon juice. Like, juicing, juicing. Instead of just chopping it up. Like, I'm juicing to where the machine, or whatever you call it. I don't know what you call it. What it, The juicer. On one side, it takes out all the pulp. And then on the other side... It gives you the juice and this is just watermelon juice and when I tell you that I've been going to the restroom like a horse you know what they say pissing like a horse or whatever whatever I've been doing just that guys it's just like whoo whoo like I'm peeing almost every hour on the hour I'm sorry guys too much information but whatever it is hey we're all human here so we all go to the restroom but when I tell you it's every hour on the hours every hour on the hour I am just going and then today, I bought these glass containers. I wish I could pause the video and run downstairs and get it. But I have these glass containers that's probably 16 ounces. So they're about this tall and about that wide. So I filled up like eight of them with watermelon juice. And then today, green apples and celery. And it tastes really, really, really good, right? I only tasted it. I didn't drink it because it was warm. But tomorrow, I will be drinking a green one. I'm only going to drink one a day, whichever one it is. So, watermelon juice without the pulp. And y'all know I love a water. Like, I could tear a watermelon up. You give me a watermelon and I'm going to tear it up. And then, green apples and celery. So, your girl's trying to, I guess get back in line i'm trying to put myself back in line guys i'm trying to get back in line all right what's going on with the betrayal what's going on with the lies who's lying who's betraying well this person they disregard your feelings they disregard others and their feelings so they really don't care right it's all about me type of energy they don't care what you're saying you can be crying boo-hooing yep they ignore the needs of others around them, so they're ignoring your needs. You can tell them how you're feeling, what you need, what you expect from them, and it, it falls on deaf ears. They don't want to hear it. They don't want to hear it. It's all about me type energy. And then they have unresolved issues, unresolved feeling and issues from a breakup. So I don't know if they were in another situation here. And now they're just disregarding everyone's feelings or you were you had a breakup with this person so they could be disregarding your feelings wait a minute disregarding your feelings and they have unresolved issues guys about the breakup so if you broke up y'all still have some stuff they need to work on or they still have some stuff that they want to work on with you what's going on with the kipper let us go in some woman is sad the lady here is sad she's sad look like she's in church she's on her knees at the pew so she said they could have been in another uh, connection she could be sad because he may be seeing someone else in high honors so that woman could be you you could be sad because he's disregarding your feelings you may know he's trying to get into another situation mm. there's court here so i don't know if this man is thinking about marrying someone else in court because he sees someone else in high honors but she feels disrespected because you're not honoring her feelings sir and how she feels she could be talking to someone about it possibly having a meeting with a friend or someone she could be talking to someone about it about how she feels the man he doesn't know what to do because now he's torn between two women 
sees the two women back there. One has a bottle of wine. The other one has the wine glass. The one with the wine glass has wings, angel wings. And he just doesn't know what to do. He's holding his head. Because it's like he's hurting one woman to be with another woman. So he's disregarding this woman's feelings here, whoever that is. She could be sad. He may even be thinking about uh, marrying someone else. Yeah. There's an ending here. Maybe they were married and there's the ending. There's a bereavement right there. So that woman's very sad. That could be the person whose feelings he's ignoring. Just regarding their feelings or whatever. He could still be caught up with these unresolved feelings about the breakup or whatever is going on. I don't know. Let's dig in, guys. What is going on with this situation? So, he is he is definitely disregarding feelings or whatever. He's, he's in hermit, but it's in reverse. Meaning, he's choosing to stay away. He's choosing not to talk. He's choosing not to say anything. Uh, right now, stand to himself. This is a karmic will. It's in reverse. It could be going nowhere fast. That's because he's ignoring everyone's feelings. He's just ignoring all the feelings, people's feelings around him. He's not up in his head, but he is kind of, sort of. He still has unresolved issues about a breakup. But he's trying to pretend that he's not up in his head, but he is. This could be the justice of the peace here. They could have been to therapy, like relationship therapy, talking about their relationship, their marriage, or whatever. He doesn't want to talk about it. He's just trying to find his own balance. Or maybe she wants to find balance within the family. She could be trying to fix it. He doesn't want to fix it. This is a karmic wheel, just spinning. Yeah, this is Ten of Swords. That right there, guys, I don't know if you see it, but those are divorce papers. He's getting a divorce, so he's not up in his head about it. Now, this woman here could be the one who's having unresolved feelings and issues about the breakup. That could be her energy, and he's totally disregarding her feelings. So if you're the wife married to this person, he doesn't care how you feel right now. But you could be hurt because he's torn between another person. He's ending things. And maybe you tried to fix it. You probably tried to go to therapy or whatever. And you tr tried to have balance with the family and everything. But he could be serving you divorce papers. Something fell. Wait a minute. Oh, gosh. Guys, I'm kicking it with my foot. So I don't know what it is. I'm trying to get it right. Oh, man. I think I messed it up. Okay, I'm not even going to look at it because I flipped it with my foot. So, so it looks like in this situation, the woman was trying to fix it. He doesn't want to fix it. You could have been a therapist or whatever. But he's, he's torn between two women. Yeah. Definitely in therapy here because of his cheating. Um, trying to balance things, trying to fix things. He's out there. He's out there. The tower is going to hit. So it looks like this lady here, she was trying to make things right with the family or whatever. But he's definitely filing for divorce. He wants a divorce. That woman here, she said she could be talking about it with someone. Death card in reverse. She doesn't want it to be over. So she doesn't want it to be over. He's disregarding her feelings. Holy Spirit, clarify the sad lady up here. The Queen of Cups in reverse. I guess she realized she's going to have to take her love or stop giving her love to this man who's just, he doesn't want it anymore. He doesn't want her love anymore. Queen of Cups in reverse. 
and she's not very hopeful. So that's why she's sad. She's in church. She's praying. Spirit, who is this lady talking to? These meetings here. These cards are huge. I love them, but they're huge. Four of Pentacles. Whoever she's talking to, that person could be telling her to move on. Don't hold yourself back. Or she could be telling this person that he's not holding himself back. He's going forward. And that he changed. So either her friend or whoever she's talking to is telling her to stop holding yourself back. And that you need to change. Or he's not holding himself back. And he changed. Spirit, clarify this grief and adversity. Why is this man torn? He's trying to stand in his strength though. Even though he's sad, he's trying to stand in his strength. He could have feel betrayed. Five of Swords in reverse. What is this? He just wants to agree to disagree. But he's ignoring everyone's feelings. Five of Pentacles. He's going to leave this lady out in the cold. So guys, if this is you, he's going to leave you. Right now, at least that's what the energy says. He's planning on leaving you if you're married to this person. Holy Spirit, clarify this court here. The magician. He's standing in his power. Definitely taking you to court. Definitely. He's getting he's gonna file, guys, if he hasn't already. Yeah, he wants a new world. He's trying to move forward. Spirit, clarify this bereavement, this ending here. So guys, brace yourself. Your husband's planning on leaving you. Yeah, he doesn't love you anymore. Page of Cups. I'm not saying he doesn't love you. He's not in love anymore. He's not offering love anymore. He's not accepting your love anymore. And he's swimming away to calmer waters. So guys, brace yourself. Two of Cups is in reverse. He's not going to. He doesn't want to grow old with you. See, in the upright, you grow old. He doesn't want to grow old with you. He's disregarding your feelings. You tried to talk it out here with the therapist here. Spirit, clarify this justice card. Ten of Pentacles. So you tried to work it out for the family, um, for everyone involved. But he has his back turned to you. So you tried to work it out. He still has his back turned. Two of Swords. You're up in your head about it. He's up in his head. But you still, you you may not still, you don't want it to be over. Eight of Wands in reverse. Spirit, clarify this tower. Eight of Cups in reverse. Yeah, I think the lady here, she doesn't want it to be over. You know, and that's fine because it's your husband. However, don't stay in this energy too long. You, you guys to get up. You could be unsure. You don't know what to do with this two of wands energy. But you're not happy either. You know, if you're the lady in this, you're not happy either. You're just up in your head about it. You're definitely frustrated. I don't know if you went back to this person or they're going back to someone that they were dealing with. Holy Spirit, clarify this death card in reverse. Ace of Swords. You're just trying to get clarity on everything. But it's definitely a missed opportunity. Ladies, if this is you, you're going to have to let it go. Because your husband's filing for a divorce if he hasn't already. And he's turning his back on you. Now your friend, whoever you're talking to, they're probably telling you that you need to move on. Don't hold yourself back as well. But he's definitely disregarding your feelings. He doesn't care. Even with the therapy or whatever before he filed, he still doesn't care. He's not listening to anybody. He just wants to move on and he wants whatever this other woman is. So guess what? Let him have it. Let, let him have whatever that is. Let him have it. Because what goes around comes around. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.